there are only a few of you who have the strength to fight the darkness. Hello Access, here's an important question. Which would you choose, a week in sunny Los Angeles or the chance to play Destiny before anyone else? Well, trick question, because our lucky competition winners Russell and Joanne got to do both as we flew them out to E3 before letting them loose on Bungie's amazing new shooter. Our brave man on the ground was the wonderful Adrian. Take it away. Hi, it's Adrian here, standing in for the PlayStation Access crew out here in the wonderful sunny Los Angeles. I'm joined here today with Russell and Joanne who have won a fantastic competition to come out and stay in this lovely hotel and come and play loads and loads and loads of Destiny. I'm looking forward to getting hands on and seeing what the guys have come up with. So yeah, this is literally going to be first hands on with the game. Yeah, it is. I believe we're amongst the first few to actually get playing it, so looking forward to it. First stop on our trip, the PlayStation press conference. We've just arrived at the Sony conference pre-party. As you can tell, it's a great atmosphere. We're hoping that we're going to see a lot of Destiny. And we weren't disappointed. An exclusive alpha, a beta starting 17th of July, the all-new Glacier White PlayStation 4 Destiny bundle, and bucket loads of other new games. Next day, we braved the excitable masses of E3 and headed off for our first hands-on with the game. <laughs> It was great, it was very enjoyable. Every corner you turned, there was some, some action going on. It wasn't like you were trying to run through one side of the map the other before you found something to do. Yeah, good, good size maps. Yeah, it was great, very enjoyable. Hope you get hands on some more. Next, it was off to the show floor to take in the sights and sounds as we waited for a very special event organised by the guys over at Activision. We're fed it back to an event behind closed doors after the show had ended. We're giving wristbands and it just allowed us to walk in and out and play as many games of Destiny as we wanted. Every booth had a, a mentor and the guy who was our mentor was actually a co-producer of the game. So we got chatting with him for a bit and you know, it's, you don't get to meet people like that. These guys have been there all day and we're staying at night to do a special event. It was fantastic. So as we say goodbye to E3 2014, I'd like to say a massive thank you to PlayStation Destiny and of course Russell and Joanne. Hit subscribe now for everything from the world of PlayStation.